guys, Matt and Jason here from Premier Aviation HD coming to you today from Gundy's Air Park where we're getting ready to uh, depart to head to Sundance Air Park for a fly-in slash air show. Uh, performers such as Kyle Franklin and uh, Skip Stewart will be performing there today, which Skip Stewart, I saw him at Oshkosh two years ago, one of my favorite air show performers. Um, looking forward to seeing those guys and meeting up with Jerry from, uh, from Sundance will be there as well. Um, just a quick update, last night we weren't sure if we were going to be able to, to do this flight because of the pending weather coming into the Oklahoma area. Both Jason and I kind of looked it over last night and decided that we'd make a go-no-go -no -go decision this morning. Woke up this morning, checked the TAF. Uh, Tulsa is in the clear. It's going to be VFR all day. Uh, Oklahoma City area, it's going to be a little bit sketchy going over that direction, so we're going to keep a close eye on it. Looks like uh, it's going to be VFR. Sorry. Looks like it's going to be VFR all day until around 11 o'clock. It goes to marginal VFR, so we'll keep a close eye on that. So, uh, hope you guys enjoy the video that we're going to bring to you guys, and uh, stay tuned. All right, guys, so we just turned the cameras on here, me and Matt. Uh, you know, Matt did the intro for the, this video. We're headed out to the air show uh, at Hotel Sierra Delta or Sundance. Uh, we're going to stop at Wiley Post, like you were saying earlier. Uh, we're going to stop out there for, for breakfast at, uh, at Annie Oki's at uh, uh, Papa Whiskey Alpha or Wiley Post. And uh, we've been playing it by ear, just, just kind of flying in from Tulsa. Uh, just, you know, uh, keeping an eye on the weather. Uh, we turned the cameras on now. I just wanted you guys to see. Um, it's it's been, it's been straight VFR the entire time, uh, basically. We've been at 3,500 but uh, we're starting to get into some other stuff here so just I wanted you guys to uh, specifically those of you that are maybe uh, going through your, your your training right now or um, haven't spent a lot of time doing cross country this is this is kind of what you would call a scattered cloud layer we're above it and we're we're we're, we're definitely legal because we're about a thousand feet above uh, you should be a thousand feet above 2,000 feet either side or 500 foot below. We're kind of pushing our boundary here with this cloud right off our right. But uh, I wanted you guys to get, get kind of a visual rep representation of what the, the kind of the kind of weather you can run into. And I wish I had an angle out that right side window. That's beautiful. Yeah. And it goes to show you just uh whenever you're planning a flight you can never be too sure on the weather you know looking at the weather last night we were pretty you know we we're pretty sure it was going to cooperate but i was a little uh hesitant i was awake till about two this morning and, and looking at the weather it just you know it seemed like it was going to be worse the farther west we went and uh it's actually turning out to be a beautiful day i've got blue skies above us and cheese fries behind us. And cheese fries behind us, that's right. We're gonna have to find a hole and shoot through it. I wanna be over those towers. Yeah, those towers are way up there. Yeah. We're above them, but still, we wanna be uh, west of them before we start our descent. Exactly. Right. Yeah. And see the uh, the weather there at uh, at Wally Post right now is information called that current winds one seven zero at six. So out of the south, we'll be landing one seven. Visibility is one zero. Sky is showing four thousand eight hundred broken. So that's that stuff up there. Yeah, a little bit above us. Uh, temperature two three. 2.17, altimeter is 3005. We're looking good on all that. It must be on the other side of this little, right, chunky layer here. And so you always need to have an escape plan. Like if we get over here and we see that this closes up, do a about face. I'd come right back here. Go down, down and go it. underneath it. Yep. We've done our share of scud runs, but. Always err on the side of safety. 
And guys, uh, I know this video won't be up before, but just remember the reason behind Memorial Day. You know, if you That's see right. a vet walking out, you know, down the street, say thank you to him. Please tell him thank you. Those guys won't be around forever. And, you know, they sacrifice, you know, their time, and a lot of them sacrifice their lives to make this such a great country that we live in. And especially with what's going on in the news right now with the VA. Yeah. Man, those guys, they don't deserve to be treated like that. No, they don't. All right, we're going to keep an eye on this, guys. Uh, these tops are definitely coming up higher than uh, they were previously, so... Need a thousand foot above them. I see a nice little path here I could kind of squeeze through. We'll wait till we're west of these towers and then we'll we'll, we'll descend through a hole. Yeah, we'll cut through it, yeah. Three five seven two Zulu. I actually disappeared. All right, we're ten miles out. Okay, so almost we're twelve point oh. Where the kind towers of, are. Kind of skirt to the left there just a little bit. Okay, right there. Uh, so guys, Matt's, uh, he's my navigator today, so I can, I can focus on flying the airplane. Alright, I have the towers in sight. The suckers are so tall. See them right through that hole? We're yeah. not going to shoot through that hole. No. All right, so uh, pre-landing checklist. You'll go ahead and hit that landing light on since we're... Yep, landing light on, fuel pump comes on, make sure it goes full rich. Okay, we're on... On our fullest tank, everything looks good. You got your seatbelt on? Yep, seatbelt's on, 126.9er. It's a tower. And... Ground's 121.7, we'll put them in as soon as we switch to tower. Kind of scoot to the right here just a little bit. Yep, got it. Almost. You see this tower over here, Jason? I've uh, got it. We're staying at at or above 3,500. You see that, that one right over there? I've got them right here, okay. yeah. You guys should be able to see that on this left go camera ahead. view. Maintain 3,000. 50 feet. Go ahead and go up 50 feet there. Yeah, I got it. We're passing right over them right now. I see them right here off the left wing. Yeah. Okay, come to my right. Okay, there's a hole right there. Okay, go ahead and start your stint. And up to the approach, Warrior 72 Zulu starting our descent now. 72 Zulu, Roger, you can come up Wiley Post Tower 126.9. Have a great, great day, sir. Okay, over to Wiley Post Tower 126.9. Have a good day, sir. And good morning, Wiley Push Tower, Warrior 3572 Zulu's with you out of 3,100 inbound for the visual. And we have information Quebec. Uh, excuse me, information Charlie. Cherokee 3572 Zulu's, Wiley Push Tower, left base, runway 17 left, clear to land, wind 1507. Okay, uh, clear to land, runway 17, Warrior 72 Zulu. And uh, update weather here, uh, it's going to be about broken around, uh, I'd say, 3,300. Roger, thanks for the pirate. Glad we got that on video. Yeah, me too. At no point did I feel unsafe. No, no point at all. Not at all. Opened right up in front of us. I'm freaking hungry. What's our pattern altitude down here? It is uh, 2,300. So 300 feet to go. Roger that. Oh, 
whatever. Lake Hefner here. Lake Hefner. Every time I say that, I think about the Playboy Mansion. I know, right? <laughs> good old, good old Hef. Good old Hef. You Hefner. As many of you guys remember from uh, previous episodes, our last trip over here was uh, <laughs> a little bit different. Us, yeah. We had a, uh, you know, as soon as we landed, exited the, the runway onto the taxiway and had to have Jason get out and inspect the uh, the nose tire and it had come off the rim. So the guys at Atlantic pulled us off. And uh, Long story short, and $600 lighter on the wallet, we were able to depart while they post back to Rivers. Actually, we went to Gundy's that day. Yeah. That was a good video. That was the day you got that, uh, <laughs> you got that look on your face. Oh, yeah, the turbulence, man. That was great. All right, runway looks clear. I don't see anything. Great. I've got one aircraft holding uh, over in the uh, run-up area, the run-up pad there. I'll call your altitudes. You're out of 1,900. Roger that. Yeah, that's scattered. That is scattered. That's scattered. There's 400. Three hundred. Wally Post Tower, six seven seven nine or seven, ready to roll at one seven left, westbound. Just six seven seven nine or seven, Wally Post Tower. Hold short, runway one seven left, plenty traffic. Holding short at 17 left, this is 9 or 7. 100. And 50. 40. 30. 20. 10. Zulu, able turn left on Alpha 5, hold short of Alpha, ground point 7 off the runway. That's left on Alpha 5, we'll hold short of Alpha, ground point 7 off the runway, 7 to Zulu, thank you. Right. Good morning, Wiley Post Ground, Warrior 3572 Zulu is Alpha 5, hold short of Alpha, going to Antiochies. Warrior 3572 Zulu, Wiley Post Ground, taxi to parking on Alpha. Taxi to parking via Alpha, Warrior 720, good morning. Good morning. Wait. And we're going to pop this door. Get some air. Uh-oh, missed call from Deidre. Uh-oh. Wonder what's going on there. Wherever you are in the world, share your aviation. Share aviation, a network for pilots by pilots.